Okay, uh, I'm going to just do a little thing here on starting up a shellfish hatchery and I just figured it might be more sensible if I just did uh, a little bit step to step on it. You need uh, some sort of a culture chamber for your uh, pure algae cultures that you have to maintain in order to uh, keep your algae up. So, best thing you can use is just a, a used bar fridge, or you can buy a new one if you get lots of money. Little control box there that uh, you use to control the temperature from a refrigerator into the range that you want for a growth chamber. And you can see that one there where it's set. So you always keep a thermometer in there to get a boat decent idea to keep what's going an idea what's going on so we're running around about 12 degrees Celsius and uh, the light actually produces most of the heat that's required in there and this will come on to keep it cool whenever it gets too warm just an ordinary grow light that uh, you would use for growing your uh, your plants in your little mini greenhouse and every day well three or four times a day is nice you come in and you just swirl your algae cultures keeps the algae mixed up so it's going to be up where it can get the light and it also aerates the mixture now you can put carbon dioxide into it that'll give you a little faster growth but um, don't really need to do it. So your cost is around about $69 or $70 for one of those switches. Something for a grow light that can be oh, $12 to $26 depending on the size. Often we'll put another one down below when we are growing a lot of stuff. A few 200 mil flasks. I'm not sure what they are right now. And a used fire fridge, which you can probably find. Uh, let me see. This one cost me 10 bucks. So, there is your algae culture chamber right there. Under 100 bucks. Talk to you later. Bye.